Hi, welcome to the Andrew Buckle book review of The Big Read, Book of Books. Now this is from DK and obviously the BBC, the nation's 100 favourite books, 176 pages and this book came out quite a while ago, about 2003 and you can see the sort of selection of books that be included, you can see there, nice pile to give away some of the clues. Now they're in order, I'm not going to particularly give the order of which ones are the most popular etc, but there's a good selection of books, most I've sort of read some of, some I haven't. I mean, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, absolutely superb. What it does, gives a bit of obviously information, background, etc. You've got some lovely pictures there, as well as obviously some illustrations, as well as, of course, other examples there. And also a story in that shape. i not show that, because you may not have read it. Certainly you have. His Dark Materials, absolutely brilliant. I've read the first book. I have never read any of them more. Maybe a, bit, a few other ones. However, Hitchhiker's Guide to Galaxy, absolutely superb. There's not too many science fiction ones in here. I mean, Logan's Run. Why isn't that in here? I love Logan's Run. Dawn of the Dead. No, horror ones. Anything by James Herbert. Nope. Loads. Even Stephen King, I think, has just got one. The Stand. That's it. Obviously got The Hobbit. Love that. And again, you've got lots of, obviously, got the picture there, obviously the book. And also, obviously, again, more information, did you know, etc. details, etc. Oh, story of Tracy Beaker, Jacqueline Wilson there. There's lots and lots of examples, always. So, David Copeland, now that was brilliant, The Pillars of the Earth. However, I've only watched it, TV series, never read the book, but still, maybe one day I will, because it's the sort of thing I love. So it's this is what I like about these books. You just go through it and think, oh, you know what? That would be a brilliant book to read at some point. There's only a limited amount of time to read every single book. But, and of course, everyone will have their own lists of, there's Emma, Jane Austen. I think there's quite a few Jane Austens, clearly through this. Charles Dickens, of course. Rosamund Bilger, absolutely brilliant. Shell Seekers, love that. Angela Lansbury, oh, <laughs> gives it away. I've never read the book, but I've read, oh, watched a TV series. Uh, oh, good night, Mr. Tom. Excellent as well. And again, TV series, The Stand. I don't think I've read that. I might have done. Anna Karenia, I've got that. If I even say the name right. Mort, my mate, is an absolute mega Terry Pratchett fan. I'm certain he's read that and he's probably read all of the other ones as well, Terry Pratchett. I've read a few and he's always occasionally saying, you must read this, you must read that. So one day I will. And there's just loads of other, that's brilliant, ragged trouser philanthropists. Nightwatch, another Terry Pratchett, and so on and so on. Brave New World, love those ones. Anything science fiction, I'm mega fan of. And you've got Cold Comfort Farm, and many, many more. And again, just all the way through, just a great list of So you just go through this book and just find lots of great titles. I imagine that there's probably lists already on the web you can find that actually matches that. And of course, everyone will have many other sites that probably got lists of 100 favorite books as well. So you've got here index of the authors. So that's quite nice as well. So you've got there. And also you've got index of the book titles. You've also got the ones that also made it, of course. And it's got a lot. And Terry Pratchett turns up quite a bit. Weird Sisters, The Hog Father, and so on and so on. So there's a long, even more books to check out. If you think, oh, you know what? I wouldn't mind reading. I've never read that one. Goosebumps. Son Love. I love D.H. Lawrence. So you've got D.H. Lawrence there. Read many of those. Tony Parsons, Man and Boy, and so on and so on. So it's just a absolute joy to read all the way through this so uh really nice also i picked this up in a nice in a charity shop so it was reasonably inexpensive as well and just a pleasure to read so totally recommended the big read book of books